Hi, welcome to another quick tip for the Hummingbird Solix units. And today I'm going to show you how to customize a view. So if you're not familiar with the views, you've got two columns here. I've got five presets of my favorites and I've got three more on this side. So these are the favorites, the ones I tend to use a lot. But let's say I want to make a brand new one. How do you go about doing that? So you go to views and down here it says new view. So you click on that. There we go, it took a second. I'm not sure why there was a delay. And you can see I can arrange this any way I want. I can have just the whole screen be a view. I can split it 50-50. You can actually, actually also split this 30-70, the same one. And again, stacked on top of each other and so on. So the, the amount of options you want to do is really endless. So let's just say I want to do the 3070. So right here, I would click that to 30. Oh. oh, I think I have to choose it first. There, there we go. So I have to choose it first. And then I can click on this and it's going to split on, on this one 30% on the left side of the screen and 70 on the right. Whichever one is highlighted is the one you're choosing. So if I'm going to choose this one first, let's say I want to make it a uh, mapping, I would click that. And on the right side, these are my choices down here. So I've got 2D, uh, HD, I've got side imaging. Maybe I want to do side imaging on the right. And then I would just save it. And now it's saved into my folder and here it is right here. And again, if I want to put this, I just click it. And bring it up. So here it is the 30% and 70. And now I just go to my menus. Go to number two and I can add it right here. Just hold it down and there it is. It's the 30-70 split. The funny thing is in the image, it looks like a 50-50 split, but obviously you can see right here, it is 30-70. So there's your quick tip for today. Thanks for watching.